Hello folks and welcome to Cisco Baltic Edition. You know, 2014 is a fantastic year to be in the collaboration business. Just a few months ago, Cisco brought out a new range show, high-end telepresence endpoints for meeting rooms. And this week at Cisco Live, Cisco announced a new range of personal, rich collaboration endpoints. And here to talk about these and the announcement is Mr. Timo Jolkin. Timo, the DX70 and the DX80 are the new endpoints. Yep. Could you talk about that for a minute? What are the main features that you would see? Well, first of all, both the DX70 and the DX80, they are a personal collaboration endpoint, as you mentioned. So they are designed to sit on a desk. Um, the, the key idea of the endpoint is that it's, first of all, your personal telepresence unit. So we've had the EX60 and EX90 for uh, four, or four or five years now, and they've been our highest selling telepresence device uh, to date. And, and with the DX series, we are fully refreshing the experience. So the DX70 and 80 are based on a touchscreen, full HD, Android platform. So even though it's your personal high-end telepresence device providing up to full HD quality, it's also your personal collaboration device. So it has access to full Google Play Store. You can go and download your Web WebEx application there or your Citrix receiver to be able to, uh, at the, to access your uh, remote desktop, for example. Um, or even play Angry Birds, you know, during your <laughs> telepresence meeting. I I'm sure you would. Yeah, of definitely. Course, nobody would do it, right? <laughs> yeah, so uh, even though it's, it's designed to be your telepresence endpoint, now it has access to all your productivity tools that you need. Okay, and, and, and who would you see, who would be the main user of the DX70 and the DX80? Yeah, so I'd say there are three different user groups for this. So first of all, of course, a home user. So I, I mean, I, I have an EX90 at home and I really love it because it enables me to work from home. Uh, but I think that with the new DX endpoints, uh, having them at home, it, even, it brings even more flexibility because now I can attend uh, a WebEx meeting from there or a third party meeting if somebody is hosting something that I can run on Android. Mm -hmm. um, and, and the price point is also so much lower that we can scale it to, uh, to a wider range of home, home users uh, from now on. So, so home users? Yep, home users be, one. Okay. Um, a second would be the executive offices. Gotcha. So as we've had with the EX, that was the executive experience. So it's designed to be on your personal office environment uh, mm -hmm. or a quiet room in the office. Um, but that doesn't really get us to where we want. So we want to have collaboration as in the previous launch in every meeting room, but we also want to have it on every desk. So if home user was one, the executive office was the second, so the third would be definitely the every desk aspect. Okay, so now we're getting into the area where you know, normally you would have a PC and you would have software yeah. running on your PC. Yeah. Now, explain to me, because there are a lot of people out there who probably think, well, if you already have software installed on your PC, why would you need to have an <laughs> yeah. additional device sitting on your desktop? Um, I would argue it has to do with quality. I mean, a PC breaks down, your AC adapter might you know, fry and, and all that stuff. Exactly. But are, are, there, are there more reasons why you would choose a DX70 or a DX60 instead of yeah. running everything on your laptop? So, in my opinion, it all comes to peace of mind. So, in, in many aspects. So, when, it, when, you are in a, when you want to attend a meeting, you want to be sure that the quality is good. Mm -hmm. So, that's peace of mind for the quality. But it's also the reliability, as you mentioned. So on a PC or a Mac or whatever uh, software, uh, software endpoint that you want to run, there are always things that can go wrong. You have the wrong audio devices selected. That's my problem always. I, I, I don't know where my ha headset is and I'm in an open office or I plugged in a headset but it's using the wrong microphone so nobody hears me or it's using the wrong camera. So w with a the, with the hardware-based endpoint, you always know what you're going to get. It's ready to use immediately when you want to have it. So that's the peace of mind and, and the, the, uh, the uh, static all, always on high quality. So that's, that's the good things. So if you're out there and you're looking for something that would bring you peace of mind, great engineering, great design, and something that works every single time, and you want to be sure you can be an efficient communicator in a meeting, you would probably go with a DX70 or DX80. And if you want something bigger, we have more endpoints there as yeah. well. So thanks for watching, folks. Um, we will be bringing out more updates uh, on, on other launches that were announced at Cisco Live. Thank you.